So you're thinking of moving to Port Royal, South Carolina, just outside of Beaufort, South Carolina. In today's video, we're gonna look at some of the best dining, some of the best shopping, and of course, we're gonna talk real estate. So don't go anywhere, let's get started. To know everything there is to know about the South Carolina Low Country, whether it's Bluffton, Beaufort, Hilton Head Island, or Jasper County, then subscribe below and tap that bell for notifications so you'll be the first to know about the current market here in the South Carolina Low Country. My name is David Simcox, host of Low Country Lifestyles and a local realtor. I get calls and emails every day from people just like you and you and you looking to make their move to the South Carolina Low Country, and I absolutely love it. So, whether you're making your move in three days, or three months, give me a call, shoot me a text, send me an email, or book a Zoom call, all in the description below, so I can help you find your low country lifestyle. In today's video, we are in Port Royal, South Carolina. That's a little historic district just outside of Beaufort, South Carolina. We're gonna look at some of the shops, some of the restaurants, and of course, we're gonna talk real estate at the end. So don't go anywhere, let's get started right now. So, if you want to learn about this very historic city that dates all the way back to the 1500s, you can stop in here to the historic uh, Port Royal Foundation Museum, talk to the docents, learn a little bit more about this incredible historic area. All right, so if you need to pick me up and you need some coffee or a snack or a lunch, come on down here to Corner Perk in Port Royal. These guys also have other locations in Bluffton and I think one in Hilton Head, but I think this one in Port Royal is probably my favorite. Go for an Americano, go for an espresso, a cappuccino, whatever you need to keep on going for the day. All right guys, now if you have a sweet tooth while you're here in Port Royal, you gotta check out Carolina Cuppity Cakes. And I don't need to say anything else, I'm just gonna let the cupcakes speak for themselves. All right, so another great stop here in Port Royal is Maynard's Ice Cream. And I absolutely love the mural on the side of their building, but I love their ice cream even more. So if you're in Port Royal, stop in to Maynard's Ice Cream for a special cold treat. All right, so this is one of my all-time favorite restaurants, not just in Port Royal, but in the entire South Carolina Low Country. This is Fish Camp on 11th Street and the food is absolutely incredible, and the view is even more incredible. So you're looking over this uh, waterway here, and the shrimp boats come in at night, and as the sun is setting, this is really like a storybook setting. Fish Camp on 11th, one of my favorites. All right, so this is a really cool store here in Port Royal called Nuances, and their motto is the art of joyful living. So if you love to shop and you like some really cool and kind of eclectic gifts, come in here and check it out. It's incredible. All right, if you want to try something truly unique, you can actually dine in a one-room schoolhouse here at the, uh, the old schoolhouse restaurant, and they have plenty of seating outside. All right, so I'm here at Devil Dog Headquarters. And here in Port Royal, we have Paris Island. And Paris Island is the Marine Corps Recruit Depot. It's where the US Marines go for basic training. And once they graduate, the new Marines and their families can come here and show their pride by buying some merchandise. So if you're in Port Royal, definitely stop in to Devil Dog Headquarters. Okay, beer lovers, now it's your turn. This is Shell Ring Ale Works. This is an indoor and outdoor beer garden right here on the water in Port Royal. They've got all kinds of beers to choose from and of course, an incredible outdoor scenery and vista. So come check it out if you love a cold brew. All right, so if you're in the mood for some comfort food here in Port Royal, check out the Smokehouse on Paris Avenue. You've got pork chops, you've got burgers, you've got nachos, you've got wings, and a really cool outside seating area. So if you wanna hang out and enjoy the beautiful weather, great little spot here in Port Royal. Okay, so if you're looking to pamper yourself and you're in Port Royal, you've got Effinence, Effinescence, I don't know if I pronounced that right, Effinescence Yoga and Spa, and 
circa 1810 salon. So beautify yourself and pamper yourself. All right, so this is really an amazing treasure of a store. I'm gonna take you guys inside. This is called the Gas Lantern, and it says apothecary and mystical, and their motto is be the light in the dark. So you're gonna love some of these amazing treasures in here. I mean, you could spend literally hours in here exploring because there are so many unique items. I mean, things that you would not find anywhere else. I mean, I've never seen anything like this before. And what do you guys think? All right, we got some other folks in here shopping. We got some really super cool old historic hats. And what else? Oh, Superman. So if you want to come treasure hunting, this is definitely a super, super cool place to come and check out. Like I said, you could easily, easily spend an hour in here and uh, looking at all of these really unique items, things that you would never find anywhere else. So this is actually a really cool business. This is the Zen Den and they call it the healing house and they have all kinds of facial treatments, they have waxing, all kinds of wellness services. Uh, let's see, we've got CBD facials, microcurrent facials, uh, chemical peels, all kinds of different waxing services. So come into the Zen Den and uh, get well. So here's just a couple of really cool little restaurants. You've got Chef Frank's Bistro and you've got the old school New York style pizzeria. Really neat little spots right here in Port Royal. So this is a really cool little shop right here in Port Royal. It's called Mrs. B and Company and they have all kinds of really unique gifts in there as well as art from local artists. So definitely stop in and look at some of the amazing treasures in Mrs. B and Company. All right, so if you're in Port Royal and it's a hot day, you definitely have to check out the Port Royal Railroad ice cream. If the kids are with you, they are not gonna give you a choice, but definitely come down here and get you a scoop of ice cream. All right, so the last place I wanna take you here in Port Royal is a local hidden gem. It's called Sands Beach, and it's right here on the river, directly across from Paris Island. And if you don't wanna go out to the beach at Hunting Island on the ocean, or you don't wanna make the drive all the way over to Hilton Head, but you want to spend a day at the beach, you can come here right in Port Royal, and it's right here on the river, and set up shop and have a great beach day. And really, the thing that is really amazing about this spot is people find some uh, amazing shark teeth out here. I know my next door neighbors, their kids have found some giant shark teeth right here at Sands Beach. So if you wanna spend a day at the beach and don't wanna drive all the way to Hunting Island or Hilton Head, come right here in Port Royal to Sands Beach on the river. All right, so before we move on, I need a snack. If you've never had boiled peanuts, you're gonna have to try them. You're gonna live in the low country of South Carolina. We've got boiled peanut festivals and all kinds of different boiled peanuts, but Benton's boiled peanuts are probably my favorite. So before we move on, mm. Mm. so good. Now, let's get on to what we've all been waiting for, some real estate and some houses. First, I'm gonna drive you around, give you a little tour of the neighborhoods, and then we'll jump into my computer and we'll do a real quick market snapshot so you can get an idea for what the market's doing here in Port Royal.
Okay, now we're going to jump into my computer and we are going to look at the uh, Port Royal area and get a feel for that market. So real quickly, Port Royal, as I mentioned, is near Beaufort. And just to get you acclimated where we're at here, this is Hilton Head Island. This is Bluffton. And this is downtown Beaufort right here. And Port Royal is right over here in this section where you see these green dots and these green dots represent the active listings. And it's right here near Paris Island, which is the Marine Corps training depot where they have the uh, new recruits train. So active listings right now, just to give you uh, a couple of ideas, that's a rental. Uh, okay, so here's one for 413,000. Just give you an idea of what you get for the money. All right, so this is a new construction. And here's one, let's see what else we have. Looks like some townhomes for 480. Again, uh, you'll be watching this video probably months or maybe even years in the future. So the inventory will definitely look different, but just gives you an idea for what you can get for the money. Let's see what else we have over here. Cute little historic house for 413,000. Oh, there we go. All right, just gives you an idea. And if I look at a list view, looks like there's 18 on the market right now. A little house. Uh, this is a condo for 335. This is a condo for 535. Here you've got a house for 413, one for 402, a uh, couple of rentals in here, a couple of more townhomes. Um, this one's kind of neat. This is a uh, older historic home for 797. And uh, of course, new things come on the market all the time. This one looks like it may actually be used as like multifamily rentals here. Here's one for 895. All right, and then if I go in here and let's just go closed in the past 365 days, you can see in the past year, there have been 173 sales in this area. So that just gives you an idea. And you can see in here, there's some for 259, there's some for you know 340, all different prices but there's some you know affordable places there's some rentals in here and uh, so that just gives you an idea for what the market looks like right now so appreciate you taking a look at the market and of course you can call me for more details all right thank you for staying till the very end i hope you enjoyed the tour of port royal some of the shops some of the restaurants and we learned a little bit about the real estate market here in port royal as always, my name is David Simcox, host of Low Country Lifestyles and a local realtor. And if I can help you find your Low Country Lifestyle, give me a call, shoot me a text, send me an email, or book a Zoom call, all in the description below. And of course, don't forget to like, subscribe, and tap that bell for notifications so you'll be the first to know about the current market in the South Carolina Low Country. As always, thank you for spending time with me. It's been my pleasure.